Hello Puppet fans! And welcome to this lecture. In this lab we will use the custom fact in node group classification to assign the MOTD class. In previous lab we have configured the MOTD module. Now in this lab we will create classification node groups and will declare classes. Next we will use the custom role fact inside the Java module. So to manage the environment and module content edit the puppet file and add entries. Mod MOTD. Git equals greater than https colon slash slash github.com slash the devops cloud slash MOTD dot git. Colon branch equals greater than production. Once you are done with changes click on commit changes. Now deploy the code from github. As we have already scheduled the cron job to deploy the environment in every 10 minutes. So you can wait for cron to run the command or you can run the command. Puppet code deploy production hyphen hyphen wait to deploy it now. Once the deploy is successful check if mod module has been downloaded in slash etc slash puppet lab slash code slash environment slash production slash modules directory. Now let's create classification node groups. So click on classification give a node group name select environment and click on add to add the node group. Next go to rules of your newly create group and select the fact role, and specify the value as rhel6 base. You can run the command factor hyphen p role to get the role name, if you have added the custom role and custom role fact lab. After selecting the role fact you will find the matching nodes list who have the role rhel6 base. Here I have only one node to match role fact. Next click on configuration tab to add the MOTD class. And click on add class. Ok so to explain, here with this rule the MOTD module will get installed on the servers which are having our HEL6 space role. Now click on commit changes to save this rule. Next verify the changes by running the command puppet agent hyphen t on node 3. As a result of puppet run you can see that the MOTD has file has the new content to print server operating system, FQDN, processor, kernel and free memory. Ok, so in this section we have used custom fact to assign the MOTD class through node group classification. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have time feel free to move on to next lecture.